I am the Nature Hacker, and this is your world. Today I want to discuss Lugol's iodine and it seeming to disappear on the skin. Some people will say that if it doesn't, if it disappears before several hours later, then you know that you're low on iodine. Well, this is totally false and it's just laughable. Now, I am the number one biggest proponent of iodine. I sell it online in my eBay store. I have probably the hottest iodine product on the internet right now, as in the most sold in a short period of time. And um, that's not what's happening. So what's happening is you put the iodine on your skin. It seems to absorb in. And some people are like, well, if it, does, if it stays on your skin for a while, then that means that you have enough iodine in your blood already. Well, this is this is false and the reason it's false is because it doesn't absorb in it just doesn't I mean it's it stays in um, the first couple layers of your skin for weeks at least the reason why it disappears is because it gets reduced so iodine when it's oxidized is brown slash purple iodine when it's reduced is clear so what happens is it goes in your skin, it, it, it seeps into your first layer of skin, and then your antioxidants reduce it, making it clear, and that's what makes it go away. How do I know this? Well, simple. I've put iodine on my skin a lot in the past in certain areas, and, you know, over the last, I don't know, a while. And you know, I, I stopped doing that about a week ago. Now today... I was washing my skin with hydrogen peroxide and all of these areas that I had put iodine on my skin weeks ago that had long since disappeared and I thought absorbed into my body they all came back all those places brown came back why because the hydrogen peroxide reoxidized the iodine so it shows up on the skin so in all actuality iodine you put on your skin is not getting absorbed in the body at least not in the not within weeks to months later will it be absorbed, possibly. And it's just sitting there in the skin getting reduced. So if, if it disappears quickly, that means that you have a high antioxidant status. If it takes a long time to disappear, that means that you are seriously low on antioxidants. Which, you know, could be a bad, good or bad thing. I mean, if you're trying to detox barium and strontium from your body or BPA then yeah, you're going to want to have a lot of oxidative iodine. So you're going to want the iodine to stand your, as a test to see if you're high in oxidative conditions to detox barium and strontium. The iodine test on your skin will show you that yes, if it's staying on your skin for a long time, brown, that means that you're highly oxidative and you're detoxing barium and strontium. If it disappears fast, that means you're highly reductive or antioxidative and you're doing well detoxing mercury and lead and things like that. So that's a real reason why um, Lugol's takes a while to, to disappear or not take a while to disappear. I am the nature hacker. Take care.